water is very precious to us we have to save water that is our duty also 98% of water present in oceans and seas only 2% of water is available for human use we must and should save the water rain brings water to the earth that must be saved heavy rains brings more water to the earth we must harvest rains and cyclones fills the rains and cyclones fills the low lying areas wherever on earth cyclones also brings massive water to the earth must be reserved for future heavy rains brings more water to the earth we must harvest rains and cyclones fills the low lying areas wherever on the earth rains and cyclones also fills rivers that should saved in reserve projects we should save water in daily house activities water it is connected to the rivers rivers are overflowed because of this water addition in our house we are using more amount of water for toilet and other activities we are wasting all this water so we have to save the water we have to construct the sinking pits to each and every house that must be every man's duty saving water in the home must and should done by every citizen the low lying areas must be identified in the villages and other places the places should be con- constructed the reservoirs the man made reservoirs or helps to recharge the underground water and also this is very useful for agriculture use water is very precious to us we have to save water that is our duty also saving water make as a habit save water save life water water every way try to save it if you care life starts with water save water save the world the world is in in your hands water is life treat it right every citizen's duty to save water save water save water save water every drop counts reduce your use